I've been working for the last three months on a 3D ski cabin scene in school and we decided to use this as the setting for our Christmas greeting because it looks warm and inviting. Also it's a cooler background than anything else we have access to down here for this kind of project. I did a 100 frame render of the cabin from a locked off camera in the scene and I used that to make a continuous loop. Next Jenna and I had to get into the scene. For that we went to the school's green screen studio and filmed ourselves using a Canon SLR. Merry Christmas everybody! I took that footage into Adobe After Effects where I keyed out the green screen, added in the cabin, created our shadows, and did color correction. The audio from the camera in the studio was terrible, so we decided to re-record our dialogue. This may look like a closet full of junk to you, but we actually have the sleeping bags up on the walls to kill reverb. Eric's got his audio recorder hooked up to the laptop, and we're going to do the voiceovers for our video. In Apple Soundtrack Pro, we used the multi-take editor to get our lines just right. And then we added in some fire sound effects for realism. Merry, Merry Christmas, Christmas everybody. everybody! We'll be seeing all of you in Alaska shortly. And hope to see the rest of you as soon as possible. For the introduction portion of the video, I wanted to do something with Northern Lights. I'd seen some Aurora animated with Flash on the Chena Hot Springs site, and I decided to give it a try in After Effects. I then used Photoshop to create the foreground. Finally, I put it all together inside of After Effects again. For the conclusion of the video, we wanted a very handwritten feel to our text. To get that, we actually did the writing with a dip pen and bottled ink that were sent to me by my friend Jeremy Egger. That was then scanned into the computer and animated in After Effects. For the very end of our video, Jenna did a digital painting of Jesus in the manger. I do my digital painting in Photoshop. My method for painting consists of about five steps. First I block in shapes and color. Next I apply my shadow and highlight layers, both of which I blur pretty heavily. Lastly, I add definition and texture. The project gets a final tweaking and then gets passed to Eric for animating. And that wraps up the making of our 2010 Christmas video. Merry, Merry Christmas, Christmas, everybody! everybody.